just to be a part of this and what it means for the team, the seniors and the coaches and, and the whole community and Georgia Tech itself. We're definitely not satisfied. We want to go out with a win, with it being the, the senior's last time putting on a Georgia Tech jersey. For this to be the last go around, last time to play together, it's going to be a special, special game to be a part of. Welcome back to All ACC. Always a great scene in Tampa for the Gasparilla Bowl. And here you see what Haynes King was able to do this year in his first year as a Georgia Tech starter. One of two Power 5 quarterbacks with 2,700 passing yards, 25 passing touchdowns, 600 rushing yards, and five rushing touchdowns. I got to take a breath after saying all that. Joining only Heisman winner Jaden Daniels. Wow, truly phenomenal season. We're so happy to welcome in Haynes King from Georgia Tech, done with his finals. So I'm sure breathing lots of sighs of relief. Haynes, thank you so much for joining us today. And when you look at those numbers and the fact that only you and Jaden Daniels accomplished that, how do you feel about the season you were able to have this year? Uh, it almost makes it even sweeter. Uh, I, w I was never really worried about uh, the individual uh, accolades. It was always team first and, and play each play at a time. And uh, as long as you win, win one single play, one single drive, one single game, uh, if you worry about what, what's happening in the moment, everything else will take care of itself. Haynes, it, we're, we're talking so much right now about quarterbacks in the transfer portal and where are you going to go and who's, where's people going to land. You went through this last year, and I think you were probably one of the great success stories of the 2023 portal market. Of course, your time at A&M had its ups and downs. Um, what led you to the decision to go into the portal, and do you have any advice that you'd pass along to the guys that are, that are doing it now? Um, the Growing up and... and, and Talking with my dad, I, I was we were never really big on the portal, but he said there were two ways that that you were allowed to to enter the transfer portal. One is being the, the whole coaching staff leaves, or two, you've tried it for three or four years and you graduate transfer. Uh, and I, I tried it for three years, uh, graduated, uh, you know, had a couple injuries here and there, and other things didn't work out. Uh, so I, I just felt like having a, a new place might be the 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 right thing to do uh, and while I was in the portal I felt uh, what was best for me was not finding just anywhere to go finding the the right place to go the right fit to being around the right people uh, and not just being coaches or or players but being both uh, with, with finding the right coaches finding the right players and finding the right um, fans and, and atmosphere to be in Haynes, what was it about Georgia Tech that made this right for you? And the second part to that is, did you envision this type of season when you signed with the Jackets? Uh, one of the big decisions uh, that coming out, one, finding a, somebody that, that I, I felt uh, I can be a part of and, and having a, a chance, uh, an equal chance to, to play. Uh, I felt like Georgia Tech would, would be the, the best option for me with Know, already knowing Coach Winky uh, and then meeting Coach Key and Coach Faulkner, all of them great guys. Uh, gonna they're straight shooters uh, and they just want the best for the athletes there. And then as I came on a visit here, meeting the team, uh, it, it just kind of fell in place. And it was like, yeah, this is this just feels normal. This feels like home. Uh, it, it just felt like the right thing to do. And I just rode rode with it and intact it and. Um, I was I was all on board, and I mean, with with what we did this off season, I felt like we were going to have uh, this kind of season or or even better, and uh, it, it this season definitely didn't disappoint. And, uh, you know, it's it's funny because I think we can look at all these numbers that show what a great year you had, but I don't think anything uh, quite explains what you are as who you are as a player just watching you compete. The Miami game in particular, like everybody talks about the fumble, but I, t I look at the way that you handled that final drive to get into the end zone to win. That's, that's Haynes King right there is the level of competition. And so when I hear your coach talk about how much having the chance to compete in a bowl game means to him, it means to your football team, 
with so many other folks kind of writing off bowl games as everybody's in the portal or opt-outs or whatever, what is the playing in that bowl game and having that chance to go out and compete with your guys one more time, what does it mean to you? It means everything. Uh, you know, growing up, I, I never – Never was allowed. Like if I started it, I was gonna finish it. Uh, and like I said before, it, it was each team has one full season together. Uh, the next season, people are gonna leave, people are gonna come, um, and it, it'll be just a, it'll be a different team. But uh, this team has one full season, and this is the last game of that season. And to go out there with all your teammates, with all your brothers, with the seniors, uh, and, and what everybody has been through, like why not finish it? Why not play in it? Uh, you know, it, it, instead of making excuses of why not to do stuff, it, it make an excuse to do stuff, to, to get stuff done. And uh, that's just kind of how this whole team is wired. That's how this, this whole school is wired. And, and it's, just, it's just amazing to be, to be able to go out there one, one more time uh, and, and put that jersey on, it, it means a lot. Georgia Tech's going to return awesome. their leading passer, their leading rusher, and their leading, I think, five receivers. So we look forward to what <laughs> you guys are going to put on the table for 24, Haynes. Thank you so much for joining us today. Thank you. Thanks, Haynes.